Hello dear brothers and sister Welcome to my class As I am teaching you the grammar classes Today very very important grammar I am going to teach you Which will help you In the SOS improvement examination Which is coming soon Let us start today's grammar uh, if you are new in my channel, then please subscribe my channel and share it as much as possible. Hoi sense. Today I am going to teach you hoi sense, which are most important for SOS improvement examination. Present continuous tense. Hoi sense of present continuous tense of affirmative sentence. As you know that. There are two voices active. One is active voice. The formation of active voice of present continuous tense is subject plus M is R plus. What are M is R? M is R the helping verb of present continuous tense. Then V who? What is mean by V who? V one plus ing like play, playing, sing, singing, dance, dancing, so like that. Then after we have to write one object. Finally, we have to write some extension like place, time. So let us write one example. I I is the subject of this sentence. Then here M I am. So what is before suppose T C T E N C H I N G T C I am T C I is subject of this sentence M is helping her or present continuous tense T C is before yani ki present participle and object I am T C English English so what is Extension, suppose now. I am teaching English now. Let us write in passive. What will be the passive? Let us write the passive formula. What is the passive formula? To make the passive of any tenses, in the very beginning of the sentence, we have to write the object as subject. Object plus same helping verb. M is R plus formula B plus half should be in third form. We have to write a verb in third form. Then after by preposition. Not only by sometimes the preposition will be sense add into which to, to like a difference according to verb. Then here we have to write the subject. Finally the extension. These are the passive form of present continuous tense in affirmative sentences. So let us write the sentence. I am teaching English. What is the subject? I is the subject. M is helping her. Teaching is before. English is object. To make the passive form, in the very beginning, we have to write the object. What is the object of this sentence? Suppose English. English then after M is R. English is third person singular number. So we have to write here is. Then after formula B. Now half should be in third form. Teaching is in people. Now in basic form, half should be in third form. What is the third form of teaching? Taught. Teaching, t taught, taught, taught. T A U G H T. This is taught. Hard, third form. Then after we have to write. But then subject. What was the subject? I. Subject we will write as object then it will be me. Then now. These are the active and passive form of present continuous tense. Very simple. Just you have to understand the formula. You have to understand the system. So you should learn it clearly so that it will help you in the upcoming SOS examination. Still, if you have and subscribe the channel, then please subscribe the channel. The name of my channel is the speaker. 
Cap is here. So let us write, suppose this was example number 1. We will write example number 2. He. Suppose. He is the subject. Then M is here. He is. Then people. Writing. Suppose he is. Writing a story. This is. He is the subject of this sentence. Is his helping verb. Writing is before a story is object. To make the passive, what we have to do? We have to write the object in the very beginning. Then what is the object? A story. A story. Then according to formula. A story start person singular number, then we have to write is. Then after formula, what we have to write? Being. A story is being. Write will be in third form. Writing will be third form. What will be the third form of writing? Written. Then after we have to write by. Then he will be here. Him. This is very simple. He is writing a story. A story is being written by him. Let us write another example which will come in the examination. That will help you. Suppose they are they are doing doing the work. They are doing the work. They is subject. Are is helping verb. Doing is people. And the work is object. To make the passive, what we have to write? Let us write. The work. The work is being. The work is being. Do did what will be done by they will be done what are them. So this are they are doing the work, the work is being done by them. So these are three examples that I have shown here according to formula active and passive. Present continuous that these are affirmative sentence. There are a lot of rule and system to sense the voice sense. Then I will teach you class by class. So I want you subscribe my channel and learn the grammar part so that it will help you in different kind of examination. The SOS improvement examination is coming. It will help you a lot. And not only SOS improvement examination, in different kind of examination, it may be tech examination, it may be different kind of interviews or different kind of jobs, it will help you. So I wanna you to subscribe the channel and share it as much as possible. Thank you for watching. See you on next class.